Hello friends, welcome to our channel Knowledge Amplifier and in my this particular video, I am going to discuss one industrial application of the image processing concept what I have discussed up to now, okay? So we have seen image addition and image subtraction in both case that is add to different image, subtract to different image along with that adding one offset value with one image and subtracting one offset value with one image okay these things we have seen now you know that our current industry is moving towards automation that is robots are replacing the uh, human job okay like for example the work which is dull or monotonous human will feel boring we can replace robot instead of human so the robot will not feel any monotonicity in the work right because it has no emotion okay then if you consider dangerous work then dirty work then difficult work everywhere we are introducing robotics and automation to uh, make the job simpler and investing the human intelligence idea in some other appropriate place okay which is difficult or where uh, some intelligence is required each time there human can invest human uh, power we can invest but for performing dull work or simple work no need to do that okay so based on that one application I want to show you. So this is widely used in industry is image subtraction. Okay. You may think where image subtraction can be used. See same uh, case study like earlier I have discussed that is finding to finding the difference in between two images. Okay. So suppose I am reading one PCB circuit. Let me just show you. I am show X. Okay. So I am just selecting this part and performing evaluate selection. I am having one PCB circuit board uh, which is already designed and suppose this is standard one. Okay. There is there is no defect present in this board. Okay. Now what we do? We take this map of this and store it in our computer. Now next time whatever batch is processing we will take one image from that and we will subtract the, from this particular original one which has no defect and we will try to find out whether some difference is present or not if difference is present huge difference is present that means there is some defect in that newly formed sample right so this is our original pcb which is having no defect and what i am doing let me just copy this and i have I uh, used IM read to read my second image which is suppose newly formed PCB board. So I am selecting this particular part and I am show Y. Here you can clearly see here in between these two parts there is one cut. Here one cut is there. Here this particular part is also defective. Okay. So there are defects present. Now if we assign one human being to identify defect between, between original image and this one then obviously there is possibility of mistake along with that this is very uh, monotonous work human will find this boring sometime also after doing for a long time so what we can do we can replace by uh, concept of our image processing okay so what we can do uh, Obviously, the two images should be of same size. So here, as I have taken manually uh, from Google uh, images, so what I have done, I have done IMD size so that after uh, subtraction, we will not get any error due to unequal size. Okay. And then subplot 1, 3, 1, IM. So X, this is our original image, title, PCB image without any defect. Okay. Subplot 1, 3, 2, IM show Y which is having title image of PCB which is manufa manufactured okay newly manufactured and subplot 1 comma 3 comma 3 I am so X minus Y which is having the title error that is the difference in between uh, zero defect and the newly formed okay what I will do let me just remove these parts so now control A evaluate selection okay and see here how beautifully we are getting our output see this is our subtracted image and from here we can clearly understand where defects are present quickly we can find like here white two white spots are coming you can see this is our uh, zero defect but here uh, the newly found PCB has here one problem here one problem right then here one spot is coming let us check see consider this particular part the black spot is uh, near to this particular uh, perimeter of the uh, this circular shape but here in this particular uh, zero defect uh, PCB it is at the center so that it is giving one difference okay then here we are getting some white cut this is due to 
this particular defect okay which is not present in our original pcb design then here one circular type of deep circular type white spot we are getting why if you consider the same place here consider in this place and this place this is bigger circle this is very small circle so that we are getting this defect okay then here consider this part here one cut is present but in our original pcb there was no cut so that this particular white spot is coming another very important white spot here it is appearing right you can check see here in this particular part defect is present which was actually not present in our uh, zero defect case okay so using this image subtraction simple concept you can understand that way that defect is present in our newly manufactured product or not easily okay so this is one application similarly there are thousands of application of image processing concepts in our industry and our current industry is moving towards that more and more because computer vision image processing makes job very much simple okay here you can understand if we assign one human being then human may miss one particular defect also if that is very minute defect okay but image processing machine will never uh, do that kind of mistake right so this is what i wanted to show you i hope you have understood this uh, this particular domain has thousands of application in this real world so try to figure out those implement that learn with me have fun and thank you for watching